Hello, welcome back to Piano Voice in Eden. Today we are learning introduction to piano. Lesson 103. So in the previous lessons, we located our C, that's the first lesson. Two black keys and then to your immediate left, white key. We call it C. And then the next video, we learned the intervals that's the movements that we have on the keyboard naming this movement moving from a key to the next immediate key we call it a semitone or a half step and then moving from a key leaving a key that's omitting a key out to the next key we call it a whole step or a tone so right now i'm going to introduce you to sharps and flats that is the main lesson for today. So, a sharp is a step forward. That's a semitone forward. That's to the right side. So, anytime we move from a C, and then we move a step forward or a semitone forward, that's to our right side, we call it a sharp. So, this is called C sharp. So on your keyboard, I'd like you to locate the number of sharps that you are having, the number of C sharps that you are having. Same way if you are D, and then we move from D to the next key. We move a semitone or, or a half step to the next key. And that black key over there is called D sharp. But as we can notice over here, between E and then F, there are no black keys so there isn't any sharp over here between these two keys same applies when you're at f and then you move a stem a semitone or a half step it's called f sharp so sharps are basically movements for it yeah half steps half steps semitones and so let me introduce you to the symbol for sharp. The symbol for sharp is the ash symbol. Yeah. So flats are just the opposite of sharps. Flats are the same as sharps, but just opposite. So sharps, we were moving forward, semitones. But flats, we are moving backwards, a semitone or a half step. So when I'm at D, and then I move back. A semitone that's to my left side I move back a semitone we will call that a flat so from D if I move back a semitone this is D flat same applies to A when I'm at key A or when I'm playing the key A and then I move a semitone backwards it's called A flat so when I'm at key E, and then I move a semitone backwards, we call it E flat. So this is key E flat. So that's how we call the black keys. They can be sharps or flats. You can use them interchangeably. So right now, if I'm at C, and then I move the key forward, this can be either C sharp or D flat. So you use it as you like it, the ones you feel more comfortable with. I hope you have learned something for today. Thank you very much for watching.